The federal government says it has concluded the verification of 69,854 core civil servants receiving salaries through the Integrated Personnel and Payroll Information System, IPIS. The head of the civil service of the Federation, Dr. Falashadi Yamiesa, sent this in Abuja during a news conference to commence the 2023 Civil Service Week. The head of service said her office had also begun the verification of non-core ministries, departments and agencies by registering about 205,411 officers in those MDAs. Other programs to mark the 2023 Civil Service Week are Public Service Lecture on Thursday, July 27th at Conference Center State House Abuja at 10 a.m. and Juma Prayer on Friday, July 28th at the National Max at 2 p.m. Others are Aerobics and Sports at the National Stadium on Saturday, July 29th at 6 a.m., Gala and Award Night at Conference Center State House Abuja at 6 p.m., and Church Service at Exosia Church besides Zeus Hotel Mabushi in Abuja on Sunday, July 30th. A lot of work has been done towards ensuring that the IPPIs becomes um, a very, very important and clean system. When we started, we identified a lot of gaps in the system and those gaps have been systematically one step after the other closed and so right now um, the core civil service we have verified every civil servant that is in the core civil service and in that process we identified a lot of fake letters we even discovered staff that had uh, that were not employed at all and found their way onto the IPPIS um, system. We also saw officers who were employed rightly but they did not upload their records onto the IPPIS system. And so we have concluded um, verification of 69,854 officers across all NDAs um, in every state and FCT. So we can say with some confidence that we have 69,854 civil servants that have been verified and that are on the payroll today. We've also started to work on the non-core MDAs. And so far, we have gone out, we have registered about 205,411 officers that are not core civil servants. That is, officers that work in agencies, parastatals of government. We will go ahead and verify these officers to ensure that all their documents are correct, and then we will move them on to the IPPIS salaries. We hope that by the end of 2024 we will have completed um, verification of the non-core civil servants. We have concluded that of the core civil servants and now we are working on the non-core public servants. The objectives of the previous annual performance evaluation report system in the public service. Though noble, we didn't get the results we wanted from it. And that is why we are now working on this new um, employee performance management system and also the institutional performance management. Right now, the Office of the Head of Service and eight MDs have actually concluded work on performance planning and contracting for officers and so they are ready to go. The head of service also has been announcing to permanent secretaries that by 2024 the APA will not be used for promotion in service. The scores on performances of staff will be based only on the new PMS system.